be really careful mm -hmm. with stuff because it could be toxic or mm -hmm. it can change in their diet can mm -hmm. create diarrhea or vomiting, things that nobody really likes, whether it's you or your pet. What you can do is get some. My best friend recently published a really cute bark cutie board recipe. Oh, I'm sure. All the um, the things that your pet likes that stay for them. So you could put a little bit of cheese on there, put some of their favorite treats, put some of the fruits and vegetables that they like to put on, like carrots and blueberries, for example, and just kind of let them have their own little treat board. Okay, that's adorable, actually. They, they kind of get to eat. Plus, if they get their barcuterie board, you could put that off to the side, and while you and your family and friends are eating, they're not sitting by the table with those sad little faces. Exactly. <laughs> it's a win-win. And what about um, the electrical cords? Because we now, I, this, I swear, this dog that we have, she'll eat anything, and it includes even in the garage where we had just, uh, you know, cords, like, that were all bound up or whatever that we use for extension cords here and there. She ate through one of those that just happened to be sitting there. So I can only imagine that now you've brought things into the house that need those kind of extra cords, and you've probably got batteries and different electrical connections and things. Uh, what should you do with those to try and keep the pets away from them? The best thing to do with electrical cords and anything that's unsafe related to that is to take them to the wall so that way they can just get up to them on the floor and start playing with them and engaging them. Um, take them on the wall and then make sure any batteries and outlets are concealed. It's kind of like kid proof in your house. You want to make sure that you kept proof your house. What's going on at Best Friends uh, right now, and then also what are you guys looking for in 2022? Well, we have a foster push right now. We really love to have people come in and take a pet home, a dog or a cat. It would be fantastic. And we provide all the supplies and medical care and food. So it's free for you to do it. All you need to do is open your heart and home to a dog or a cat. And for a period of a week or two, which you can prefer two weeks or longer with a dog, it can be a week or longer. And if you are a big dog, you can adopt them for free from September 26th to the 31st at Best Friends or any KLA in Los Angeles. So you have a lot going on if you love animals and you have the ability to have one, this is a perfect time for that. Oh, Michelle, well, I, I wish you and your family a very Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, and thanks for all that you do for the animals in Southern California. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. We'll talk to you soon and take care. Have a great day. Thanks, Michelle, you too. That is Michelle Saffy with Best Friends Animal Society. It's the little thing that I don't think about that the dogs and cats can't have, or the dogs specifically. Uh, but I liked it um, on a list that she sent me, some of the, um, just a reminder, some of the things that they can't have. So they can't have chocolate, obviously, grape, onions, poultry bones, and then my favorite two on the list, eggnog and fruitcake. Well, since my dogs are fruitcake, <laughs> it'd be cannibalistic for them. So, there you go. But, uh, you know, just just remember, it's the, it's the plants. It's always the plants that I panic about. When people bring me something, I'm like, oh, boy, there's, you know, get it away. You can't just put it on the coffee table so it's nice while everybody's around. No, nope, no, nope, it'll be gone the minute we all turn our heads. All right, let's get back to some of these stories coming out of the KFI 24-hour newsroom. The jury meets for the fourth day of deliberations in the trial of the cop who shot and killed Dante Wright. Tim Potter is charged with two counts of manslaughter in the killing of Wright during an April uh, traffic stop in April in a Minneapolis suburb. At least four people have been injured from an explosion and fire at an ExxonMobil refinery in Dayton, Texas. Local authorities are calling the incident today a major industrial accident. The refinery is the nation's fourth largest. And a reminder of the brutality of China's government appears to be on the way, on the way out in Hong Kong. The monument that looks like a rising column of bodies massed together called the Pillar of Spain commemorates the 1989 massacre of hundreds of students protesting economic conditions in China. It was boarded up by workers at the University of Hong Kong and guards were put in place around it. People on campus said they heard the sound of drilling and clanging from behind the board. The Dutch sculptor who made it and claimed the monument belonged to him and said he wanted it back, but he was ignored by the university. City authorities have been increasing crackdowns on dissent against the Chinese government. Brian Blue, KFI News.
Well, there is a college physics chair at uh, a city college in New York who got this box. He said this box showed up. And I've never seen this kind of a box before in my life except for in the movies. And why would he say something like that? Because somebody sent the City College of New York a box full of cash. The box was full of 50s and $100 bills and added up to about $180,000. He says there was bubble wrap and I opened the bubble wrap and there was all this money. So I closed the thing up and held it to my chest and called the dean. Imagine, it is like a movie where they open something up and then they and clutch it to their chest. Now, this professor had not been in City College since March of 2020, when the physics department chair finally returned in September. There was a cardboard box that was mailed in November of last year. So it had been sitting there for four months. The return address was Kyle Paisley from Pensacola, Florida. But here's the thing. They tried to contact Kyle Paisley from Pensacola, Florida, but a person by that name at the address that's on the box does not exist. So they have no idea from where it came, but they're wondering if it was a student. There was a three-paragraph letter inside the box that may have had a few clues about the donor's identity, saying, assuming they're a bit curious as to why I'm doing this, the excellent opportunity available to me that led to a long, productive, immensely rewarding to me scientific career. If the person doesn't want to come forward, they say I respect their decision to do so, but I will, in my capacity, do what I can, this professor says, to do what the, want, the person wants us to do with this money, which is go forward and give it to deserving students. Now, the physics and math department have decided to award two full undergraduate tuition scholarships which is 7,500 bucks for the next 12 years out of this money that they were given by this anonymous donor. I love the holiday. I love the holiday. Granted, I know that story wasn't a holiday story necessarily, but it's coming out of the holiday. So All right, when we come back, I'll tell you who is testing out a universal COVID-19 vaccine that may tackle all of the different variants. Also, we'll talk about a pet food shortage and if your flight gets delayed, which is quite possible. That flight got delayed coming home last night. Well, maybe you get a surprise out of it. I'm not kidding. There's a battery thing that won't give you quick size if your flight gets delayed. <laughs> all right. I'd be mad that I'd be eating French fries while I'm out, so how bad can it be? Nick, what's up on the 14th? That better be a bucket of fries. Well done, extra crispy with extra salt, for me to be okay with it, but yeah. It's a mess with the drive fun right now. Uh, as you're making any stuff out on the 14th, uh, as opposed to the 5, actually, in fact, thanks for the heads up from Bill on the KFI traffic tip line, time to get to your cell phone. Keyword, KFI traffic. Possible police activity, definitely a wreck. On the 14th south, on the originally reported car flow left on block, but according to Bill, all lanes are set down right now, especially the 14th south transition to 5 downtown. So, you are seeing a messy drive on the southbound side of the 14th. Delay is pretty heavy from well before Golden Valley right now. And then past the overall 14th southbound gets out of the Alagoose area. Oliver, if you like Bill, have an update on this problem or anything else slowing down your drive, time to fix it on your cell phone, keyword KFI traffic. KFI and the Sky helps get there faster. I'm a team. This report is sponsored by Mucinex 12 Hour. Did you know that doctors use Mucinex? That's right. Mucinex is the number one OTC brand doctors trust for themselves and their family. So with cold and flu season upon us, why would you use anything else? Grab Mucinex and put yourself back in control. Available at CBS. This is Chris Collinsworth. Here's what's trending on the iHeart Sports Network. Presented by DraftKings. The end of an era is here. The Lakers host the Spurs tonight for their final game at the Staples Center. Starting Christmas Day, it'll be known as Cisco.com Arena. The Chargers are well represented in the Pro Bowl with six selections, and COVID-19 has made its way into the college bowl season. Texas A&M opted out of the data bowl over COVID-19 issues. Rutgers is expected to fill in for four best four. I'm Steve Lewis. Download the DraftKings app and use code SPORTS to get a free shot and millions of dollars up for grabs this week with your first deposit. Minimum $5 deposit required. Eligibility restrictions apply to DraftKings.com for details. It was the night before Christmas and someone in your house was tossing and turning like an insomniac mouse. So the citizens, you should go for the best gift of all. A great night's sleep for once 
in Fairland. It's a fit and free year on clearance sale. Save up to 50% off all the best plans. Plus, with your good credit, get 0% financing for 24 months with your minimum monthly payment. So don't let your old master close your with friends. Call Fairland Bank today. Call 1-800-522-4700. I love the holidays because you get to bring your family and friends together and celebrate and reconnect. And this holiday season, you can improve your family's everyday wellness with one little simple thing. Give the gift of quality water for everybody to enjoy. See, once you get a life source whole house water system, you're going to have filtered, delicious water coming out of every faucet and shower in your home. And it connects directly to your plumbing. It's really easy. With life source, you can skip the cost and hassle of buying bottled water. Any hassle that I can skip is a hard yes in my world. Speaking of hard, is hard water a nuisance? Reduce your hard water problems and scale build up with America's most recommended water system. And a life source water system filters out the chlorine and added chemicals in your water, so you'll be drinking and cooking and bathing worry-free. And the best part, there's no maintenance of any kind. A life source water system is really easy to make quality water easy in your life. Because there are no filters to change and no salt to add. They install it and you enjoy it. For a limited time, life source water will pay your sales tax. Now this promotion won't last long, so don't wait. Call to speak with their expert service team. With Life Source Water, you get factory direct service and expertise. Call Life Source today for full service and full confidence in your water. Call 800-334-5009. That's 800-334-5009 or visit lifesourcewater.com. Life Source Water, safe and feel the difference. As parents, we've done everything we can to keep our kids safe, happy, and healthy during this pandemic. From finding the best face masks to making sure their hands are clean. And now we have the best tool to help keep them even safer. The most important thing we can do is vaccinate our kids to protect them against COVID-19. Vaccines have been proven safe and essential for children 5 and up. Talk to your child's doctor. So visit myturn.ca.gov to find a vaccine near you. Brought to you by the California Department of Public Health. What is your 2022 business goal? Simplified IT? More security? Cloud technology has the expertise to help you. From transforming your digital workspaces to providing comprehensive end-to-end IT solutions. Get high-performance computers featuring Windows 11 Pro with powerful hardware-based security and savings up to 45% during Dell's New Year event sale. Get special financing through Dell Financial Services. Call us Dell Technology to buy through at 877 ask Dell. In 2007, Marine First Lieutenant Travis Manny was killed in Iraq after saving his wounded teammates. Travis's legacy lives on through the words he spoke before his final deployment. If not me, then who? Words that today fuel the spirit of Travis Manion Foundation. And through TMF, these words can live in you too. Show the world what you're made of. Because character is invisible until it's not. Find out how you can strengthen the character of your community alongside empowered veterans, families of the fallen, and inspired civilians at travismanion.org. If you own a business and manage to keep five or more people on the payroll through the pandemic, there's a new government program that will pay you tens of thousands of dollars per employee. And this is not a loan. This is a grant. The challenge is getting your hands on this money. This is a bureaucracy. Innovationrefunds.com cuts through the red tape, helps you get the cash. They do all of the legwork. They don't charge a penny until you receive the money. And what they do is simply share a percentage of the money they get for you. They got my business a six-figure refund. Now, their average client gets a quarter of a million dollars. That's impressive. Go to innovationrefunds.com, click on the Qualify Me button, answer a few questions. Innovationrefunds.com, it's no risk, and it certainly is high reward. Innovationrefunds.com, they help me, I'm sure they can help you. Innovationrefunds.com. Over Mental Inn, an apparel manufacturer and distributor of East Fashion Design. Mark's had bachelor's degree with major in Fashion Design. Send a resume to attention Jenna Troy at 2650 Linus Boulevard, Vernon, California, 90058. It's Heart Radio's number one for music, radio, and podcasting all in one app, where you can always hear your favorite podcast free. Now it's time to celebrate those podcasts at our 2022 iHeart Radio Podcast Awards on January 13th. Host to your favorite at iHeart Podcast Awards. Audible is a proud sponsor of the Audible Audio Pioneer Award. Listen to the best of what you love with Audible Originals, audiobooks, podcasts, and more. True crime, sci-fi, memoirs, and wellness. Audible's got something for every mood. Try it for free when you sign up at audible.com.
portions of the following program were pre-recorded. You know, I'm becoming a tech maven. What? Uh, I'm telling you. I am using FaceTime more and more. Mm -hmm. So I am. Mean, I remember. Uh -huh. You know what I have oh noticed with you? You have been butt dialing me in about six weeks. So I'm butt dialing everybody else. Oh, you know, oh, that's oh, taking off the list. Bill Handel, mornings from 6 to 10. Take it personal. Take it Sunday, and the temperatures are going to be cold as well, so it looks like we could see highs maybe just for the next few days, just in the 50s, dropping into the 30s and 40s overnight, and if you are in the mountains, there is a chance that you could have a white Christmas. And after 22 years, tonight marks the final sporting event played at Staples Center. Now the Lakers are hosting the San Antonio Spurs, and when the game's over, whoop, there goes the Staples Center logo. The last time it will be in the building until Crypto.com Arena comes in on Christmas Day. Right now, let's get into your biz bites. It's the Army that is testing a universal vaccine. It hopes will target all COVID-19 variants. And it's called SPFN, or Spike Ferritin Nanoparticle. And it's been shown promise in non-human primate trials, and early human trial results are expected this month. Now, what they're saying about this SPFN is that this jab might also help protect against other COVID other than COVID-19, so other coronaviruses. So they're saying this can offer hope against future pandemics. Now, the vaccine they, they're designing is on a new platform. That's a self-assembling protein nanoparticle. Go with me on this. I have to kind of go through this, too. And uh, they say that this SPFN um, they hope, anyway, will, break it down here, um, will somehow then create this protein that that's, that that's the way that it would fight these future coronaviruses that come in. So if we have coronavirus, you know, God forbid, 22 this year, then they hope that this will be so universal and cover so many different things that it would have effectiveness against future coronaviruses. Make sense? Amazon has revived its mask mandate for workers in warehouses because of the COVID cases. So Amazon now is asking all of its U.S. workers in warehouses to wear face masks inside their facilities because of the spread of the Omicron variant. Well, the pet food shortage, I guess it's real, and owners are scrambling in some cases. So you've got shortages of labor, raw materials, and transportation, all printing the huge human supply chain. We've talked about that. But now, apparently the challenge is the same for pet food, and in some cases it's even more acute because supermarkets executives say there's sudden high demand because people adopted pets during the COVID pandemic, and the pet owners are buying bigger volumes of food. Pet sales at supermarkets grew 6.9% over the past 52 weeks, compared with 2.3% for food overall. So we beat food by 4%, according to Nielsen. And the crunch, though, is really kind of um, putting a, a lot of owners in a hard spot because here's the thing, you've got pets who require prescribed food or they have dietary restrictions. So those dogs and cats often have to be attached to one specific brand or maybe flavor or something like that. But if you go to the supermarket and you can't find substitutes there, then what do you do? Well, many supermarkets have just said sorry, and they're leaving food shelves empty because they have no products went on those shelves. And pet manufacturers say that they are hoping to secure more ingredients and expand production. Well, travel experts say today and tomorrow, actually today, I guess, are going to be the busiest days for holiday travel, right? Shake Shack says it knows, and it's here to help. And it's offering free fries to airline passengers who have their flights delayed or canceled. Well, a nice thought. If you cancel my flight, I don't think that fries are going to get me food. I'm just saying. But still, it's the fast food. And the fast food burger chain announced it will provide a free order of crinkle cut fries between Wednesday, December 22nd and Friday, December 21st 
if you have a proof that your flight got canceled or delayed. I hope it doesn't. I still hope fries are in your future, but I hope that your flight does not get delayed. This is KFI and KOSC HD2 Los Angeles. This is your last wake-up call for me. Layla and Chris will be filling in for me while I'm gone. Be kind to me and being kind to me and letting me have some time off. So, what's up now, Jeff Bob? Good morning. How's the San Fernando Valley? Good morning. Well, I'll tell you what. First off, the whole South Valley is dark. It's wet. Most of the building in spots, so you really got to be careful. And see if you can tell already. It's as early on. There's been a lot of high speed crashes, so be careful. Right to the New Hall Pass. First, uh, from yesterday. Trash. Yes, man. 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 But going the other way, South 14 at the bayou, the terrible press, had all lanes blocked there for a little while. It's starting to clear it right now, but still a little slow from the way from the world. Now, once you get through the fast, it's going to be around the valley. Ethan. 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 A large tumbleweed, obviously looking for the desert. It's going the wrong way, but it could be passed down. Be careful and don't go there. It's going to be a pretty high in the sky. I hope to get you there faster. I'm Jeff Carr. <laughs> Incredible 